it's set in Lucite. Fans of the Mindy Project may notice Dr. Jeremy Reed is a bit different this season, and actor Ed Week says it's made his job even more fun. We find Jeremy about 15 pounds heavier at the beginning of season two, which he hates because he's a Lothario, a cad, a narcissist, and obviously he now feels like he's got this sort of fat, sweaty teenage girl trapped inside him, uh, which uh, shows itself very quickly. As soon as he's stressed or anxious, he'll sweat, he'll start to shout at people, and he'll start to eat. Uh, so uh, that's been really fun to play. Dr. L, hi, how you doing? Person here, trying to talk. Oh, I'm sorry, I... Weeks told us what's coming up in the next episode, which focuses on Mindy's latest breakup. She uh, decides she needs she needs some rebound sex, and I think uh, Morgan, played by Ike Barinholtz, is the one who steps up. Uh, meanwhile, uh, Danny and my character Jeremy have a fun storyline with um, Adam Pally's new character, a new character to the show, uh, Peter Prentice, who is a sort of a frat a frat boy OBGYN who's not behaving entirely appropriately. He also shared a list of upcoming guest stars. Timothy Oliphant. Um, who was just fantastic and hilarious, and also playing my father, Alan Dale, from Lost, uh, which was such a thrill for me. He, weirdly, he looks kind of exactly like my dad. Right Back down here, please. Weeks says the show has come a long way in a short amount of time. The show found a very loyal audience, and people come up to me all the time and say how much they love the show, how much Mindy is a hero to them. I'm going to vomit. We'll just get through it. Come okay. On. He also enjoys fan comments like this. Is your accent real? People seem stunned that a person could sound quite so British. And I can assure you it is real. This is how I've been speaking since I was about three. That's very helpful, Peter. Find Ed Weeks alongside Mindy Kaling and cast as they continue the Mindy Project Season 2. Tuesday nights on Fox. In New York, Ashley Dvorkin, Fox News.